biggest thing I usually on that side, uh, covering for sound and vision, but I'm here today as a calibrator. Um, so I just wanted to talk about the calibration. Um, everything that you see in here was done with the projector controls. There's nothing, there's no LUT box, there's nothing special going on. Um, the calibration on this turned out fantastic. Um, you are seeing the white color gamut, so you're getting 99% of P3 on this projector. Um, and your total foot lamberts on screen, even though it's going to look a lot brighter, is really only about 23, 24 foot lamberts. Um, one of the common misconceptions I think that there is out there with HDR with projectors is that you need more light to make HDR look good. But you have to remember that it wasn't designed as a bright format, it was designed as a dynamic format. We were trying to take advantage of what the headroom was on flat panels without affecting the normal range of video. Okay, 90% of what you see in HDR is in the SDR range and it never changed. What you're adding with that extra brightness is headroom for color volume and specular highlights. Mm -hmm. So if you compromise the overall dynamic range, a specular highlight will not stand out as much as it would from a, a raised black floor, which is what you get with brighter projectors. It's, you're trying to get it bright so that you can get that specular highlight brighter, but it doesn't work that way because it, the, the range between your black and your white specular highlight don't change. It's that contrast isn't gonna be there. If anything, it's gonna look worse because your black floor is raised, so you don't have something that your eye compares it to. So with this, we're, we're actually at a pretty low, but you have a higher dynamic range in there. You have the wider color, and you'll see subjectively, it looks very similar to what you're used to looking at on a flat panel. That's the whole point. It isn't to try to emulate the flat panel because you're never gonna get that bright. But you also have a much bigger screen size and a small, uh, lower brightness on a bigger screen looks brighter than the same brightness on a small screen in front of you. So you'll really get that quality when you look at it and hear they did a great job.